Yeah. yeah. Then I got married. <laughs> and then decided to take up gardening for some reason. Well, to be and fair, at least your wife lives in the town suddenly, of gardening. And suddenly Grey didn't find the joke funny anymore. <laughs> <laughs> So night zero then. Wow. <laughs> that was really fortunate. Um, yeah, this is definitely an academy. <laughs> okay. Um, well, we are one then. I mean, uh, maybe I, um, I'd like to make an argument I should go and try and shoot one, seeing as he's the one unengaged target. I think that's a good idea. He pokes it his head up finally with the e-web silence and bang. Yeah, so uh, I'll pop two strain to take um, a prone action, and then I'll aim with the maneuver and shoot. What's his range defense, Gray? Two, you say? Okay. Oh, I forgot about that. What? Yeah, I was about to say you. I forgot when I yeah I shot when I shot a guy. What is this? Also, when you're uh, shooting from prone. What's the bonus? Is it one blue? I don't think... Do you get one? Or is it strictly a defensive thing? Okay, fair enough. In which case, you probably shouldn't drop prone because being prone... Gets it's a bad idea. Yeah, to okay. Ignore... Th then, Gray, I will not take the extra action for the strain. I'll just aim with my maneuver and then shoot. Um, and uh, he's at long range. Which is only two die because I have the scope on it. Two... Uh, what is he? Red-purple? Or to red, or... Okay, I know you're throwing a token on it as well. Okay, well, I am throwing a token on it. Gray's not malicious. Um, I call bullshit. Yeah, he's malign a lot of the times, but... Okay, so that's on night one, and I will roll a crit on him. Am I getting a bonus on that? Uh, if there is any bonus, it will be applied automatically. Mm. Distracted. Well, I, I would call that being relatively distracted, yes. Oh, I put on a boss. Target oh, cannot okay. perform Bugger. a free maneuver during his next turn. It's like hamstrung, but worse. But it's, it's good enough to stop him from getting in close while, while Jar and Nock deal with the two people who are actually in the threat range. And continues to consider his options. Three also thinks about his life because he's concussed as shit right now. Yep. Oh yeah, he can do that, but just can't do anything else. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try um, and jack this guy's lightsaber. No, I... not like that, you perverts. Wait a minute. Is he's still off? holding it. Yeah, he's still he's... holding it. it... Okay. <laughs> so, Gray. What would I have to roll to get that lightsaber out of this guy's hand? I don't know, not with the force. You're just literally yanking yeah. out of his hand. Yeah. That's ballsy. Yeah. Ah, oh, shit. Can I just check why you aren't using the force? Because I don't have pole. Oh. Actually, wait, what would it take to point it at his head and then ignite it? Of course, it's always going to be brawn, isn't it? Could I point out that because you fell off jar, you're not engaged, you honestly could just shoot this guy at short range? You couldn't miss him with me. So then what's he... his brawn? That's not nearly as bad as I was expecting, honestly. Oh, Again. upgrade twice. Oh, shit, that's right. Okay, so it's slightly worse than I was expecting, actually. Yeah, never forget those two free upgrades. 
However, I did just spend some on Enhance, so I can use this. Use the Force to help me with this. Oh, wait, no shit. That's only Brawl checks. Can I can I offer one alternative before you roll that die? You could just break out the basket and then try and get on top of this small building over here. Get a vantage point going. Or you could shoot him. I suggested that, but they weren't keen. The issue is, uh, I'm not engaged, but Jar is. Yeah. Well, you could still shoot him, but you may just hit me. Yeah, which is definitely not what we want. I really want to get that lightsaber away from him, but I don't have any really easy way to do it. Well, just wait until um, Jar has smashed him into paste. Well, see, the thing is, I want to get it away from him before he can use it against you. I mean, okay, sure. I mean, that is fine at all. I Actually, do... wait, Jar, you haven't gone yet, have you? No, not yet. Fuck it, I'm gonna delay. I'm gonna go after Jar does. Well, yeah, I was gonna say the knights have all gone at this point, so we can just go as we like. Yeah, uh, Who wants to go next? Okay. I was about to say, Serpentis, all, I've the, gone. all the knights are engaged anyways, so I'll go and stab knight, to, knight one. Yeah, you may as well help knock and make sure he doesn't get ganged up on. Cool. Not sure knock uh, needs the help. It's, yeah. is, it me, is it medium or short range to knight one? Medium. Cool. You could always just pop straight and get the free move and then still attack. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Hey, wait a second. The guy's stunned. But I still need to make the test. Uh, the ruling... Well, I mean, the... Right, okay. Yeah, what's probably actually happening, the job currently has him in a headlock and is punching him in the head. You could maybe argue for a couple of blue, given that he's distracted, but he can still at least defend himself because he's not unconscious, which is a different stat. Right? You want to upgrade this? Might do as well. help. Huh. Yes it didn't no. help. Targeting yep. one, yeah. Yep, that's a crit. Oh, I don't even get the crit. You do get a crit. You don't get a oh. crit on people who are dead. Yeah. What are you going to do? Well, you the head off the corpse? He's crippled anyway. Oh, no, this would, this would be maimed. Because it's oh. possible. Oh. Right. So well, actually, you just slice a bit off of him. Actually, it would be a horrific injury, but meh. He's dead. I mean, the dead is dead. The dead. No, no, there are levels of dead. I mean, that's pretty hard. He gets suppressed by the e web on the first turn, tries to, you know, gets his kneecap shot by me. He moves forward to try and help his buddy, and then Valance takes his. bisects him with a fibro greatsword. The guys in the ship are going to be recording this. Oh, I hope so. This is a pretty Why damn good propaganda video. Hmm. Why aren't they coming out anyways? Ooh, no, Ooh, that's a very shit. interesting roll. That's an odd one. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, two triumphs probably means that he sends the gun to the stratosphere. <laughs> <laughs> I think he died from damage anyway, to be honest about it. You hit something I... very metallic on the way through his entire fucking spinal column. You accidentally, well, you accidentally hit the lightsaber. Lightsabers are metallic. Well, the light okay, bar isn't, but the lightsaber is metallic. Jar is going to pummel him into continue pummeling into the gray upgrading. Yeah, we have. <laughs> well, yeah, is he still That's alive? Not that okay. was. Well, <laughs> okay. Um, well, we've got one knight who's act pretty much, at, you know, surrendered, so... Wait, has he actually surrendered, or is he just speaking to his mum? The rules say that he is completely out of combat. 
I mean, I'm looking what? at the text now. It doesn't actually say anything about problem. It's not. I think it's what Edward Gray wants. If Gray yeah. wants. This one. If Gray wants him to run into the jungle and we never see him again, he can, or... <sighs> oh, I should maybe have a go at talking to him? Well, yeah, I mean, I'll throw you an assist, but you should be the one to do it, yeah. Well, that's a squad. Sorry, Gray? Well, he, he's first going to wipe his hands off. <laughs> um, Probably good. I think yeah. just... Uh, rendered his friend, well, his at least uh, until now, ally apart. So, like, hey, uh, notice you didn't want to fight there. Um, we cool. Er- er- everything okay? You know, how how are you? <laughs> Ilo, meanwhile, is going to collect the other three lightsabers. Difficulty, Gray? For what we just did to everyone else in the room. Um, without I, I should up- note actually taking a hit. Can't upgrade, Gray. Uh, I am going to quickly have a look. I don't know why I just don't. Yeah, it, than I expected either. Um, okay, I'm okay. I'm going to suffer two strain to downgrade that by one. Yeah, that that fight went a lot better than it should have. Don't say that. that by <laughs> after, yeah. Then Don't I'm going to after. take a light side token to up my charm, and then I one. Are you getting a free blue from? Um... Well, it doesn't matter, but no, no. <laughs> it turns out the people who decide to go and join weird cults in the jungle are easily swayed. Well, it turns out when your mates get murdered after the cult told you become invincible, you start questioning the cult's decision making. It turns out talking? when the guy who's talking to you just slammed the guy's tree into a head into a tree. God, what the fuck! So hard that it turned into dust. Well, I mean, remember. I mean, remember, I'm not making charm checks here, so this guy is now Jar's friend. <laughs> or at the very least, you've convinced him to stand down without fighting. Yeah, I wouldn't call he him needs a to change your pants. He did butcher his mate. <laughs> hmm. Like, I mean, you'd, you'd obviously be an asset for the Republic. But if nothing else, he's a source of information. Hmm. We can promise you won't be talk- tortured in a dark room somewhere. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. <laughs> Considered too inhumane. Yeah, it's a bit okay. like weaponizing Jar Jar speeches. There are some limits to the Republic or not cross. Was a well By himself. Policy. No, somehow he was legitimately popular. He spoke to the common man. <laughs> to be fair, did... Yes, I I was going to say, didn't a lot of, sort of the stuff that Hammer Team did get sort of accidentally... Well, not accidentally, but didn't get attributed to Jar Jar because there was no way they could ever recognize that we existed? I think all they the went with the stuff was group. pushed on to Jar Jar, all the military stuff was pushed on to Atten. That was it, yeah. Because yeah. Atten was still, you know, not burnt enough to still be a legitimate Republic hero. So I think the Atten was, was also a martyr. Yeah, you know? yeah, that too. Okay, so I agree. Well, Jar gives him sort of some tips, tells him about a sort of a career counselor he knows. 
And we, of course, invite him back on our ship so he can get off this place. Mm hmm. We... What's his name? We should probably ask him does anyone else here we need to worry about? Yeah. I mean, we do still have three buildings to check out. I mean, I know one of them obviously is a smoking crater, and one yeah. of them, the, the L shaped one, the door doesn't work anymore, but we still need to actually be thorough, clear out the temple, clear out the buildings, and then, mm -hmm. then we leave. So, yeah, so getting yeah, any he's... info on who's actually here from him would be a good idea. Hmm, we understand. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> really? <laughs> I'm really very glad we broke the door on that, then. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we'd love to go out and defend our base, but there's a war in the way. Oh, hey, ask him about those Kyber shipments, just to make sure oh, yeah. this isn't where hmm. we're going. If he knows anything about that. We literally went to the wrong goddamn camp. <laughs> Sorry! We're going to leave now and go to the right place. Well, no, okay. we're, we're, we're no. clear this one first. We're not leaving a hut Jedi training camp stand. It would be militarily negligent to not properly break things. Okay, well then let's go into the temple and probably break things. Oh yeah. Or we could just get back on the ship and just turbo laser everything. Yeah, there could be stuff yeah. we could steal. Yeah, as much as I'd love to just wander off into orbit. Like, I think it would be a terrible idea to find information about the other base. Yeah. That's in its orbit. Except for the historical relic. Not blowing that up. Well, yeah, but that's got the like stuff in it that we probably want to blow up. As much as I usually love playing the cautious route, I do actually agree with Jar on this occasion. There's no good reason for us not to try and clean out this base for information or anything else first, and then we nuke it from orbit with turbo lasers. Yeah, I mean, I'm or not saying not cleaning it out for information part will probably involve clearing out all the living people still in it. Don't bother with I, nuking it. We also got to yeah, we've got to figure out what we're going to do with the, the 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 Jedi still stuck in the barracks. Yeah, did you? How did you close the door in there? Well, we shot it a whole bunch. I shot a turbo laser turret with a significant number of triumphs and basically argued that it, the wreck of it had broken and fallen into the door. Ah, it's not that they have lightsabers to go through walls or anything. If they were doing that, I would have imagined Grey would have had them show up by now. Oh, by the way, here's a bunch more Jedi. Yeah, it's just, it's obviously just a malfunction. It's true. Don't underestimate. Yeah, we mustn't underestimate how short combat rounds are. I suppose. In that case, I'd say we get Dion on onto the ship, and we get into the temple and start cleaning that up. Shouldn't we? Uh, shouldn't we deal with the barracks first, like in case they do decide to get organised? Can we just turbo laser the, the barracks and then kill everyone else, and then search everything else? The, the issue is the barracks might be where they're keeping all the information. Possibly, but do you want to handle Hen Jedi? Do, do we, um... We could blast a hole in the wall and take them... Sort of essentially t t take, try to take them by surprise. Like, total lasers... Like, surprise! <laughs> total lasers can probably hit the barracks right now from where they landed. Well, yeah, we can just blow it to shit. But, I mean, it's not... 
Well, if you want, if you want to, you could just shoot it, shoot the tuber lasers over the barracks and order everyone to come out and drop their weapons. What do we do when they inevitably overkilly of warning shots? (laughs) (laughs) We won't get out of them. Okay, um, idea. Check the building that's just above it. You know, this little gray one. They're all gray. The little one that's just above to the right of it. Check that. No, no, not that one. The one that's right? No, not that one. (laughs) Check this building out. Tell them, yeah, check that out quickly. See if there's anything in there. And then use that one as an object lesson of what will happen if they refuse to come out with their weapons on the ground. Yeah, that'll work. The only thing is, if we're going to keep Dion on, just have someone from the ship take him into custody as well. We don't need him getting yeah, shot no, by we, his angry colleagues. Yeah, we, 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 obviously we, we're going to disarm him as well because, like, you know, this is, this is just, yeah, but we're definitely going to disarm them. No, we are going to disarm him. <laughs> we come back, the ship's no longer here. Mm-hmm. We have crew members? Yeah. yeah. We, we oh, like... yeah, sorry. That was something else that came up on Corellia. As part of us handing in duty, we got a proper crew compliment. Hey. We're not ordering them to their deaths. We've been very good to them. Guys, come out. If we were ordered into their death, we'd have told them to help us fight the Jedi. Yeah. Yeah. Can we get them to search the rooms so they can die to the Jedi first? (laughs) I prefer we didn't get our crew killed. Like, they already had a pretty torrid time of it. Yeah, I've I've no intention of sending the crew out. It'd be a suicide mission. Okay, are are we searching this, 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 this little building? Anything worthwhile. I mean, valuable. Okay. Lots um, and lots of bug spray. Clothing, rations, things you don't want insects or, say, bacteria to get into. One of these things is not like the other. (laughs) (laughs) But yeah, so um, Jar liberates an armful of rations. And uh, I suppose we stomp the the ship over. What do we call this thing? We don't have a name for it yet. Unfortunately, we forgot to name it between the weeks. So um, seeing as last time we tried to consider this, it took... Yeah, but we realized we'd already argued for about an hour and that our viewers probably want to kill themselves, so we decided not to. Oh, I... Yeah, we we got busy. But anyway, so, yeah, we stomp over and I suppose... I suppose we should give Nock the megaphone. He is the best at intimidating. Okay, what's the difficulty? Uh, we should get a... Hold on. We're going to make an object lesson out of this little supply thing first, right? Okay, guys, 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 stand away from the thing. So I have a skill that lets me downgrade the difficulty <laughs> twice. I don't think it's a difficulty check. Looking at the giant explosive crater on the ground, I think Gray has just decided. It's... Yeah. Well, I can downgrade that. And... So let's see. I may be yeah. a very passionate and eloquent speak. Speech, which is quite impressive since I only use one word at a time. 
<laughs> I mean, if it works, it works. Let's be honest here, chaps. There's also a ton of advantage. <laughs>